Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femik Bacha Piamina, has met with the leadership of the organized labor in Abuja on the intended nationwide protest and indefinite strike scheduled to commence on Monday, September 28, 2020. Speaker Bajabiamila appeals to the union not to go on its intended strike. The meeting is an effort to avert looming strike and to find a way to mitigate the suffering imposed on the masses by the increase in fuel pump price and electricity tariff. He explained that shutting down economic activities will further hurt the citizens and he wants the union to be a little more patient and put the intended strike on hold while the leadership of the House meets with President Muhammad Buhari over the issue. So if we agree on principle that these measures are not necessarily bad economic measures, but that the timing, you know, is uh, like they say, the, the road to hell uh, sometimes is paved with good intentions. So maybe we need to re-strategize. We will definitely interface at this point. We will definitely seek a meeting again with the executive. We will reiterate our position. But, at this, but in, the, in, the, in the meantime, in the meantime, we would want to appeal to you, quite honestly, only for no other reason but for those people out there that we seek to protect. But the president of the Nigeria Labour Congress, Ayuba Waba, laments the extent of hardship the masses are facing due to the increment which has consequently raised prices of foodstuff in the market. It is because of the fact that it has had a negative impact on the well-being of Nigerian workers and even Nigerians. And uh, we thought that uh, these policy issues need to be discussed, uh, particularly that Labour have engaged this issue in the life of our country for the past 30 years. In fact, the first increase was in 1988 under Babangida, and Labour responded. Uh, we have been able to get some mitigation measures, in some cases reversed totally, and uh, in some cases we have been able to win a lot of palliative for our members. Uh, so certainly this particular one will not be so much different. Waba says that's why the court injunction, the union will proceed on the strike if their demands are not met, stating that the intention of the action is in the interest of Nigerians. Are you not aware also that there is a court judgment stopping the tariff increase? There is a judgment, valid judgment of the federal high court stopping the increase in tariff. That judgment is still subsisting. And the yes. Are you not aware of that? Okay, so and uh, so on the issue of the court judgment, wait. We have not been served, as I said, because in good faith, you recall that we are on the negotiation table up to late uh, Thursday evening or Thursday night. And uh, therefore, our expectation is that we should be able to, in good faith, continue to dialogue, but not uh, to try to also ambush because we have not received the order as of today. The union is to embark on a nationwide protest and an indefinite strike if the federal government does not revert the pump price of petrol and electricity tariff. Gloria Kiba, called TV News, Abuja.